I don't know, I think uh, my life changed when I met him, really, for the, for the positive, for the better. Do you want to rest in your bed for a little while? Eh? Do you want to rest in your bed for a while? No. Okay. He is just always smiling, and no matter what is going on in his life, he can always see a positive out of it. He just goes and goes, and he never meets a stranger. He's just always someone that recognizes him when we're out, and very generous, has a lot of friends. He's an awesome guy. He was born with the scoliosis, and as he got older, it just got worse. And I think that's how he's remembered, is the way he's bent over when he walks. You know, it's, people recognize that and um, have treated him with dignity and respect. He loves people, he loves the community, and just getting out. I mean, he loves to appreciate nature and watching the leaves come on the trees. He kind of missed a little bit of spring this year. <laughs> he has, he's went through some struggles, you know, he's of, of not wanting to eat because he just wants to get out of there and there you go. giving him suggestions that, you know, that's going to give you strength so that you can get home again. Um, and, you know, he gets that big appetite right back because he's always been a good eater and always loved food. So. Those are the kind of things I just keep helping him with, and and uh, but whatever help I can give him will never equal what he's given me, ever. Oh, I really miss him. I don't know that I ever really looked at the world the way he does until I met him. And it's, it's awesome. <laughs>